We have a visitor. Ganoff's buddy Riley the Samoyed visited our home over the holidays. Our good friends who watch Ganoff on occasion needed a sitter, so of course it was our turn to watch Riley, and every time we watch Riley, there's never a dull moment. Let's just say they have very different personalities and interests, which makes it quite challenging yet hilarious at the same time. If you love corgis and Samoyeds, then you have to keep on watching. These two have been buddies since Gandalf was a puppy. We would always get so much attention around town with the two of them. However, quite frankly, I think Riley might even get more attention than Gandalf. Riley lived her early years in Oregon. On one occasion when we visited, I waited outside an ice cream shop with her while our friends went in to order. Literally, five different parties stopped by in the brief time I was outside to talk to me about Riley. Ever since, I've always joked that if you have any single friends, borrowing a Samoyed along with a Corgi will guarantee that you meet someone. In prior years, every time we watched Riley, we would go on photo shoots. She's just such a pretty and photogenic dog that you just have to do that. Samoyeds are actually known for their smiles, which is absolutely adorable. However, this time I was dog sitting alone for a few days since mom took the kids to see the grandparents, so we kept it low key. The weather was not all that great, plus I had to work. The question was whether I'd be able to work with the two of them. I'll get back to that topic later. When it comes to walks, Gandalf usually likes to take his time. He likes to warm up, sniff around, get some steps in before he does his business. On the other hand, Riley literally has to go the minute you open the door. She goes straight to the destination and unleashes. Since she's older now, she sometimes just walks straight back to the door, refusing to walk. On our first walk together, we found ourselves in the middle of the street with Riley doing her business. And we went straight back home. For those of you that are familiar with Gandalf, you know that he is ball obsessed. One other thing about him is that he is ruthless in terms of competition. Every time we fetch together, he refuses to let Riley have the ball. And of course, she gets rather angry. You can see her constantly bark for disapproval every time Gandalf takes away the ball from her. She just never gets a chance. Yeah. So just to make things even, I threw the ball multiple times to her directly at her. Here are the results. catch a ball, but she can catch a treat pretty darn well. Riley! Riley, look! Riley! Yeah, look at that. In some of my other videos, I've mentioned that Gandalf is very food motivated. Well, Riley takes it to a whole new level. She's usually fed twice a day, once immediately when she wakes up, and then once around 4 o'clock. However, around 2 o'clock, she starts whining. Actually, it's more like she starts protesting. It's one of those things that if you feed her too early, then the following day, she's going to ask for it even earlier. So really, the best thing to do is to hold off until her meal time. Resist the urge to give in. Unfortunately, I was working, and so this became a challenge.
We battled it out there, but overall, I really love Riley. She's absolutely incredible with kids, and my kids love her too. While Gandalf runs circles around her, you can tell that he has so much energy and is just excited that Riley is there with him. He literally will fetch twice as much when she is over. And like I said earlier, every time they fetch, there is quite a bit of commotion. Gandalf overall isn't much of a cuddler, but Riley is a cuddle bug. Here she is falling asleep on my leg. Being a senior dog, she tends to fall asleep pretty early at around 7 or 8. We would find her in these positions. see how I can call Gandalf over without saying Gandalf. Hi Riley! Hi! Hi Riley! There you go. Thanks for joining us on our adventures this week. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more cute and playful content. See you in the next video.